hi there so here's a quickie um we're going to do a three pile pick a card and this is basically um a pick a card a timeless reading where you can ask any timing question so when how long somebody will be staying um how long will this continue um when they're going when are they going to contact you again when can you travel again anything okay how long um somebody in your office is going to um if you're if you're expecting somebody to quit um how long do you think they're going to stay so pal one pal two and pal three okay and at the bottom of the deck um okay so this person you're asking um whatever they do whatever action they take it might depend on their need for money so the the actions are basically really kind of um determined by um the need for cash okay so um keep that in mind so if you chose pal one nine okay so this could be nine days nine weeks nine months hopefully not nine years um and we'll get some clarification from the astro dice okay so either sagittarius season um taurus season 11 is also significant four so um to add to the mix nine eleven four and again uh an emphasis on money and responsibility so more money more money and also the ego okay so this person how long this person stays or goes or when they'll contact you depends on how busy they are at work for example how much uh how much time they have to spend at work and if they have time they'll contact you or if you're expecting this person to quit their job because you can't stand how they bully you at the office or whatever this is they're staying for the money so i hope the sound quality is better this time because now i'm using a mic that i got for my acting class <laughs> for you know submitting homework and submitting audition tapes anyway i hope that the, the the sound quality for the voiceover is better this time but what i'm um, okay, so another thing that I'm getting with the, with the Nine of Wands here, the Nine of Clubs, which is the Nine of Wands in Tarot, is that because the Wand suit is about passion and it's about bodily things, and the Wands itself are often seen as phallic symbols, the Nine of Wands here I see as kind of a symbol of a nine-month pregnancy. So obviously, um, if you're... Um, with somebody who has an ex-wife or a baby mama, um, they're not going to, you know, leave your person's life after the nine months are over. I doubt that they would, you know, just start leaving you alone once the child is born. That's not a good idea. I personally, it's really, it's really tough dealing with this, with these, uh, baby mama issues because you, you want to be a good person, right? We, we all want to be a good person and to be a good person, we will have to, you know, help ensure that their children, your person's children from a previous marriage, um, have a relationship with their father. Okay. Cause otherwise, if you don't allow that, you're a terrible person and none of us want to be a terrible person. We all understand that children need a father figure in, in their lives, right? And um, don't think that just because somebody is is um, a, a sperm donor or a, an egg donor and you assume that their relationship with the recipient of, of that sperm or egg donation is platonic, that, that things can that things are just simply going to be easy for you and your person. Um, I recently did a reading about platonic comics and one of one of the piles actually came out as a platonic sperm slash egg donor and that turned out to be really messy. So don't assume that, um, you know, platonic sperm donors are um, simple situations. They're really not. Um, so another thing that I'm getting from this, um, this, um, so this 
nine of wands the um the, the phallic symbol is in my opinion um you know uh it, it signifies something that will go as long as the natural course of things goes on so for example a pregnancy would naturally go on for nine months and as a rule of thumb whatever is considered natural by the natural law in your quote-unquote natural habitat so whatever is considered natural in your home country in the territory that you live in so for example um if a child is considered a minor until they're 18, then the baby mama will not leave you alone until their youngest child turns 18, which means that um, if the um, baby mama or the ex-wife is a bully and she's determined to make your life a living hell and suck all the peace out of your life, then you you will be in quite a predicament. But, um, you know, that's just the, the thing with dealing with this these baby mama issues because they're really not simple and the thing about being a, um, a stepmom is that you can you can actually and I just recently learned this from watching YouTube videos is I, I um you can actually get in trouble with a baby mama for treating their children too nicely too kindly so if you spoil the child and the child takes a liking to you and they um, view you as a good cop as opposed to the bad cop that their biological mother is, you can actually get in trouble with that. So, um, you know, it's, it's, it's really, it's really not easy. And, um, you know, I, I hope, I hope, um, if, if you're, if you're concerned about a baby mama who's making your life a living hell, I really wish you all the best. Um, and, you know, you can pause this video if you, uh, want to read more oh and another thing <laughs> um I, I i really shouldn't laugh but um i while i um got this download i started channeling the the kanye west and the jamie fox song um you know the part where kanye says 18 years 18 years or whatever but yeah so there's that um so that's for pile one for pile two joker okay so here we have a wild card so this person, be careful with pile two because it, it, don't let this don't um, don't let this person find out that you want them gone, okay? Because what I'm getting from this Joker situation is that this person might actually prolong their stay in a relationship, in a work situation, in um, staying at your house. Uh, maybe they're. Um, couch surfing crashing at your house or free whatever that may be this person if they know they're not wanted there um they might actually stay longer just to piss you off so don't let on that you want this person gone okay very important um nine could be significant seven could be significant capricorn season Jupiter and Jupiter. Um, I meant to say um, Sagittarius, which is ruled by Jupiter. So Capricorn and Jupiter are around Christmas time, um, the holiday season. So end of year, early year, um, Mercury, Gemini season. And this person is a comic. Okay, whenever I see the North Node there, it is this person is definitely a comic. They were put into your life to teach you a life lesson and since you want them gone or since they are in no contact with you. I'm sorry if you think this is your soulmate, but this is likely a comic. Okay, so I hope that helped. Um, we're moving on to pile three. Nine, another nine. Okay, so nine. But this is, this person might actually leave abruptly because what the difference between this nine and this nine is, this nine is wands and this nine is swords and swords are just they just cut more abruptly they're more they're less passionate this is passion this is cold so they might actually leave you out in the cold or they might leave they might leave when they feel left out in the cold um pluto okay be careful with this person this person might have violent outbursts they might have anger issues they might have revenge issues they might have addiction problems they might have a lot of secrets um and mental health issues that they need to get help for but they refuse to get help for um this person may be prone to um 
drug use, alcohol abuse, they're addicted to something and they're paranoid all the time. So they could be running from, some, from something. So this could be somebody who is a bully at work. This could be um, uh, somebody, a relative, a friend who's overstaying their welcome at your place and they are leaving in nine and they could leave in December, June, in six days, six or 12 days, weeks, um hopefully not months because 12 months is a whole year and this is nearly a year so hopefully we're talking in week terms here especially because this person is vengeful they're prone to violent and anger issues and probably addiction okay so stay safe if you pick pal three stay safe hopefully they don't leave because law enforcement had to get in the way i don't know why i get why i got that Oh, and another thing, um, so the common theme for all three piles are their dependence on money, okay? So for this pile, I'm also getting that this person will finally leave you alone after they get a job. So if you're asking about an office bully who won't leave you alone, uh, they'll leave when they get a better opportunity, a more prestigious uh, work offer, uh, better pay, um, so there's that. Um, or they can get a promotion and they can get, you know, a promotion can, can make a huge difference. So let's say this person gets a promotion and they get, gets, get transferred to head office and you don't have to meet them anymore, or they get a promotion and they get moved to even a different floor. Just, just getting shifted to a different floor can make all the difference in the world. Um, so that's a possibility. Um, another thing is that the swords, I always uh, associate the swords with legalities, okay? So this this pile, this particular pile might... <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I am having problems with my throat chakra. I think I've been getting psychic, psychic attack, attacks on my throat chakra. Oh my god, I can't even talk. Um... So this might resonate for you if you're asking about um, time frame for a legal process. How long will this divorce um, <laughs> last? Because I know some people go through hellish divorces and they last forever. Um, because, I don't know, I just, I personally would just rather just walk away with whatever. But um, yeah, um, so this, this could, you could be asking how long will a, legal process take how long will an approval get approved or whatever so um there's that but all of these situations what they have in common is this person is staying for the money okay i hope that helped um stay safe really especially pal three okay bye thanks for watching